two hitting team. You know, they're built with the extra base hit and they've hit a lot of home runs. So the impact of the ball over the fence versus two singles sometimes is more yeah. valuable. So yeah. the average sometimes doesn't tell the complete story of the uh, the potency of the offense. And they're, they're, they've got some physical guys. You know, the lefties, there's a little balance. I like the balance in their lineup. Um, so it's tough. These things are tough to win. So specifically, Link, what did you learn about your team the way it responded to Friday night? Or, or maybe what did it reinforce that you felt you knew about your team? Um, they have a tenacity that you don't really gauge other than by watching them play. It's not rah-rah. It's not in-your-face anything um, to display the toughness. They just grind and quietly find ways to – find a chink in the armor, quite frankly, like to take advantage of the base running stuff or the whatever it is. And as you get into the game, and you have a little better sense like in game for what the hitters look like or what they've seen from your your pitchers before, like you, that savviness of, of in game adjusting and managing. I mean, I think that's what I see again this year. I, I saw it last year. We're different, like we're, we're a different team, but um, I think some of the same traits exist. Your aggressiveness on the base paths, the way that you, you guys push and like to push and force the defense to execute, how significant was that today? Huge. How important is it to get that maybe in the thoughts of future opponents as well? It's huge, and, and people know. Like, they do the exact same preparation we do. Um, they kind of look at the video and know guys that run, and you look up and down the line, line up, and just from a stolen base standpoint, you know that our team will run. But – the word is out, like going first to third and, and some of the other things that our guys have become so comfortable doing, it changes it. So you, you create an uncomfortable feeling when you're playing us. That's exactly what I want. And it takes a, a little bit of grooming to get them to understand why it's so important and how it impacts them. because. It doesn't always lead to what might be an error on the scoreboard, but a missed cutoff man or like forcing a throw sometimes um, opens things up. And they're really starting to see that. And this, this weekend was a, obviously a good example.